constitutional democracy. Uh, we kick off uh, Prime Biz as usual with a number or a chart. Let's uh, hand you over to Bongani at the wall. Bongani. Thank you very much, Francis. Now, it may not replace the lives that were lost, but the number of the day is... 1.2 million rand. That's uh, what's been awarded uh, by uh, the life arbitration hearings for gross violations of the constitutional rights of psychiatric patients. That's what 144 families related to the known victims of the life Esidimeni tragedy will receive. The retired Deputy Chief Justice Dekhang Musinege finalized hearings today and ordered the state to pick up this bill and make other changes as well. The 1.2 million rand is made up of 20,000 rand for funeral expenses, 180,000 for damages, and 1 million rand each for each claimant as compensation for the violations of various sections of the constitution. The psychiatric patients died after Gauteng Health moved some of them from private healthcare provider Life Esitimeni to NGOs who were ill-equipped and in some cases unlicensed to deal with them. Musineke says some of the patients were tortured. The Gauteng government had announced in its budget address that 28 million rand had been allocated uh, by the office of the Premier to be able to compensate the, the families of the victims. The Premier of Gauteng, David Makura, says uh, the, the rest of the money will have to be found.